Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Clarksville, Tennessee, where we find our favorite dumbass frauditor, Jeremetha, a.k.a. Auditors of America, Last Days of Freedom. And he is here to film cops as usual, and he gets rather upset that one of the cops touches him whenever he tries to film inside of the police officer's vehicle using the plain view doctrine. Well, dude, the plain view doctrine only applies to cops anyway. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Oh, you left this cat open. You're on the screen. Yep. No, man, you left the cat open. It's put. It's. Back up. Man, you can record me, you can record whatever. You're not I can record inside that car, Back too. Up. Back up. Back Don't up. Put your hands on me, dude. Don't be up in my car. Back up. Back Don't up. Put your hands on me, dude. Don't be up in my car. I can record it. You left it open. Oh. You ever heard of the Plain View Doctrine? This is why the majority of you frauditors are complete imbeciles. A simple Google search on Plain View Doctrine will reveal everything to you. And further research into it reveals even more about it. So, Jeremetha, why don't you go ahead and pull your head out of your ass and realize the Plain View Doctrine is not for the civilian world, it is for the officer's when they're investigating an, a scene, you dumbass. It does too. It applies to everybody. Back up. Back up. You can record me all you want. You're not recording in my car. I just did. Back up. Wow, you turned into a tyrant real fucking quick. Okay. Most cops don't have a problem with it. If they leave the cat open, they understand they left the cat open. Trying to find out anyway. I'm not trying to look for nothing. Obviously you are. It's plain view. Obviously if you left you it open, are. I can record it. What's your name and badge Jonathan number? Jonathan All right. Go ahead. You're about to get a lot of calls on you, tyrant. All right, I'm a tyrant. Yeah, you are, dude. You are. Okay. Put your hands on me because I'm recording inside your car. Yeah, that, yeah, that I can record mind. inside. Hey, Jeremetha, I got a question for you. Uh, when are you going to get that job, uh, per se? Because you've been saying it for years now that you're going to get a job and all that. Yet, whenever the time comes and you say you have it lined up, it always seems to vanish. And you end up blaming the trolls for your uh, problems. Well, dude, I think it's time that you actually get a job instead of going around to doing all this frauding and actually support your family with actual earned money. You know, instead of e-begging using your daughter as a uh, prop in your videos. You can call her out here. What are you, what are you, what, what are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do? You gonna arrest me? Because then I'll suit up out of you. What are you trying to do? What is the point of it? What are you trying to do? Explain to me. Uh, find out why she's on there. Exactly. Not doing nothing. It is my business. It's my wife. She called. I'm here because of what, what you, she called for, right? What are you trying? Like, what are, what are you trying to do? What are you, what, what are you trying to do by stopping me by recording it? You shouldn't left it open. I'm trying to teach you a lesson. Oh, wow, big lesson I learned. Shut your cat next time if you don't want people to see it. You want your you, you, you say it's secret information, right? Well, it's it's secret top secret. Then why can't anybody fucking see it? It'd be different if somebody just walked by and looked in it, though, wouldn't it? If there is one thing I really hate about uh, editing your videos, it is all the damn swear words that I have to take out. I mean, if these some other frauditors have the common decency to swear in the video and then edit it out later. Oh yeah, speaking of your daughter, are you going to homeschool her and uh, teach her to be a flat earther just like you? Because yeah, I know you're a flat earther, which is kind of surprising considering all the damn evidence there is for uh, a spherical earth. Well, not so much a spherical, an oblong spheroid. I mean, but still, dude, get real.
Do what? I don't want you in my car. That's I'm not in your car. You're looking in my car. Right? I was looking in your car. That's right. For what? And I can For do what? that. I can do that. Exactly. It doesn't matter you what. Have no I have a reason. All the way over there. I do have a reason. For what? You can't be that dumb. How long you been a cop? Don't worry about it. How long you been a cop? Two years. What do you want to know? Two years. What do you want to know? Two years, and you don't know that if you leave that open, it can be recorded. What do you want? I want your sergeant here right now. For what? I want your sergeant here right now to file a complaint on For you. What? I want your sergeant here now. No. For what? Will you call a sergeant? What do you call him? Right? That's what I, call I want to file a complaint on him. No, I won't. Uh, so I, I can do it now, too. Get me a sergeant here now. Call your sergeant. Call your sergeant. Call your sergeant. You know, you sound like a little whiny crybaby. Is it any wonder why nobody respects you? Is it any wonder why you probably lose all those jobs if you talk to your prospective employee employers like that? I mean, if I saw you behaving this way, I certainly wouldn't hire you. I'd hire somebody with a better attitude than yours. You're about to find out who I am, because obviously you don't know. You put your hands on me, dude. Yeah, you put your hands on me. I, I will be get telling my showing that to my attorney also. Yeah, good, good, you're great, yeah, you're great. Qualified immunity is a bitch, ain't it? Because y'all don't ever pay for nothing, do you? The taxpayers do. Put your hands on me again, you see what happens. Because I'm not being detained. You can't walk. You can't just walk up and grab somebody. You can't just. No, I didn't. Recording since the get go. Uh, because that's what I do. I've been recording them too. All oh, since they've been here. Do what? Nope. Don't worry about it. Where it's going? YouTube. Yeah, he's gonna put it up on a YouTube channel that has less than a million views on it. So yeah, it's not gonna get widely distributed or widely viewed. I mean, dude, you're you're pretty much a loser as far as the frauditors go. You're a low man on the totem pole. So in other words, you're a loser among losers. It's going to go in a lot of places. It's a lot of places. A lot of places. You're about to be famous. I've always wanted to be famous. Not in a good way. It's not good. Are you that dumb that you realize what you did was wrong? Hey, Jeremetha, are you that dumb that you can't figure out the antonym of famous is infamous? And antonym, the meaning of that means a word that's the opposite, such as good and bad. They're antonyms of each other. Can you study that and actually learn what that is before you spout off a bunch of BS that you don't even know anything about? I would... Really? You, was your car locked? Yep. You worried about it? Yep. Yep. I know we're just all criminals, aren't we? That's that's what you implied. Okay. That he's about to do something. I don't know his intent. Why he's fucking? You knew I was recording the screen, okay. and you knew that's all I was doing. Don't ever put your hands on me again. I really hope your body cam's running. Well, I am just going to have to cut it short on this video because, you know, this video is well over 30 minutes long and I don't need these idiots to come after me with a copyright strike. But we get the idea of how poorly educated, how poorly mannered, and how ignorant this guy is. And he worked his way up to being this much of an ill-mannered, uneducated, moronic buffoon of a bird brain asshat. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.